What's going on everybody? My name is Chris and welcome back to some more Let's Play SpongeBob SquarePants movie video game. Last episode we ended off by doing this freaking block challenge. Give me a bit of trouble, it wasn't too bad. We're just going through the path to Shell City right now and it's pretty freaking bananas. And we come to this place like, oh, we can blow it up. But before you do that, I want to jump up here because there's a sneaky, sneaky treasure chest. Bam! And I unlocked a new extra. That's a very sneaky one, actually. If you didn't know that was there, then, well, it would, might shock you that it is there. Look, oh, look at my things going up on my weights. I'm carrying a lot of weights. Fish hook hand. Oh, we got fun sound pack as well. Oh, I just found a French fry under the seat. <laughs> Hold on a second. Let's let's turn off music for a second. Turn it off for two seconds, and now it feels awkwardly quiet. Wait, what? Except now I'll go back. Now I'll go extras. Now I'll go here. Here comes the pain train. Goofy, goofy, goober, goober, yeah. Yeah. Yummy. Who left this here? <laughs> Talk about pretty rock formations, Patrick. This one's a beaut. I always say that. They say that on the rock slide. The power of music. That is a line for later. Metal forged by the power of rock. That also comes later. I, 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 I. Never heard that before. My valuable time. Wait. My valuable time. I don't have any valuable long time. How dare you talk about such things to me? I lost my valuable time 60 years ago in the war. All right, I'm done. Uh, oh no, oh no. Okay, probably you can adjust your aim when you start to throw those. Oh, I should have probably caught that one a bit through, more through. Come on, come at me. Will these guys make it to me? Come on, come on. Why are you just standing there, you butt? Uh, no! What the heck? Wait! Like, come on! There should be some very obvious um uh, priority here over what you're aiming at. I'm holding it. Ah! Not the slidey stuff. All right, give me another one. There we go. Ow! Oh, great! Super! Super! Now we gotta deal with that asshole too. All right, let's go over here real quick. Oh boy! Oh man, I didn't even aim at him. Ah, oh, so frustrating. No! I'm about to die anyways, but you know, <laughs> so sad. I'm so sad right now. Don't, don't touchy. Yeah, I missed. How'd I miss? I hate this game. <laughs> Come on. There's a, okay, let's see. We have a freaking... Oh, no, oh, man. You know what? Never mind. I was going to comment about the, my surroundings, but screw that. All right, let's use this as a test. See, I did get the treasure chest here still, right? I did. Okay, great. Good to know. All right, let's just go past all this and collect all my loot. Buff pants thing. All right, can we even aim... I don't think we can. Oh, we can! Did that do it? It did, yes! Yes! Whoa, that is not what I want to aim for. Oh, I almost had that switch! Right. Don't, dude! Dude, you can't hit me twice! With the same attack? That's against the gamer rules! That's like getting hit by a bullet, and then like the bullet legs, and you get hit by it by a second time. There we go, I hit it. Yay, now let's just go. Screw it. Ah! It scared me, I did not think I was going to make that jump. <laughs> oh boy, I did not even see that coming, and I still killed him. That is how great I can be at this game sometimes. Most of the time, not at all. Oh boy. Uh-oh. Ah! Ah! Oh boy, okay, uh, not good, not good at all, uh... Holy crap, that was cool, I can't even be mad at that, that was really neat. Oh, oh, I'm just kind of surprised it was put here, I thought it was going to be put right back at the beginning again. Alright. 
Don't have to worry about this too much. No! Oh, you're already stunned. Although I did stun everyone else around. Dude! Stop being a butt! Oh man, I did not. Oh man, I didn't want to press that! My fat fingers! My fat fingers! They're not eating me at all! Oh god. God shave the queen. No! I missed! Push it down too hard! Oh, I blew it up. Oh, okay. I mean, I. Oh, I guess I should take those off first, should I? Oh, man. No! No, I'm gonna die! No! Go uh, on, pick it up! Oh, I was pressing it, I wouldn't pick it up! Oh, Alright, here we go. Got this this time. Alright, this is some difficulty right here. Right here, man, yeah. Yeah, man. Did I get him? I did. Super. What's this do? Anything? It is something like, oh, you have to get both. Apparently it is. All right. Your mom's kind of hitting on. <laughs> uh, uh, all right. Oh, boy. No! You bastard. I will not let you die. I Let me die. I will not. Yeah. Yeah, some. <laughs> did I do it? Yeah, I did it. Okay, great. Oh, man. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, I didn't knock me off the ledge. I'm like, okay, maybe there'll be a cutscene that'll save me. Probably shouldn't have expected that. Oh, there's a burger over here that I missed completely. Alrighty then. Dude, I hate you. I can't even deal with you because I have nothing to throw at you. Uh, now I do. <laughs> Dude, stop it. Yeah, I hate you. <laughs> Uh, I, I could probably hit that from here, but let's try this the actual way. I'm gonna trample balloons. Whoa, more leg. Uh, ah! Oh, I was like, I did not break it for some reason. Yay, the <laughs> picture stayed on the screen even when it exploded. SpongeBob, where'd you come from? SpongeBob! Alright, I think that's it for this level. Collect our Goofy Goober token. And tempt fate by proceeding until the next level. Name's Dennis. Does that mean what I think it means? Uh, oh. Imagine if someone found this, like, lifesaver here. It says loading, loading. It's like, why does it say loading? I don't understand. Hello, boys. He caught up fast. He has a knife! Who are you? Your worst nightmare. A big pile of broccoli? <gasps> no! Dennis, I was You're not a big pile of broccoli. Look, buddy, I hate to burst your bubble, but you're talking to two men here. We don't have time for these silly games. So if you could just step aside. <laughs> oh, help me, Patrick! Really? He's a SpongeBob with a hammer? That's hilarious! Okay, I remember this being pretty difficult. Hit him! Okay. But I also remember the last boss battle we had being pretty difficult as well, and it wasn't, so. Oh, don't hit SpongeBob out of a pure drunken rage! Ah, maybe that's why I remember it being difficult because of these assholes. This music's pretty cool as well. Holy crap! Ouch! Aw, oh, man. Get out of here. Holy crap, they explode in a gaseous explosion. You can't use... Uh, uh, biochemical warfare! It's illegal! <laughs> oh, man. Well, now we gotta wait for that to despawn. Alright. Oh, he's already at health. half health, though. Alright. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna wait. We're gonna kill this guy. There we go. Now we're gonna wait for him to jump. Jump. Jump, foo, jump. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Why are you waiting so long? There we go. Ah, dude. Alright, now go over here. Ah, there we go. I got him. Yeah. SpongeBob does not seem to care about all the abuse he's taken. Oh man. I could very well die here. Uh, yeah. ah! Stop laughing at me, you butt! 
Dude, there's way too many guys. There's way too many guys. Oh, perfect. <laughs> no, no. Okay, it's coming down. Oh, no. Oh, no. Whoa, what? What happened? I don't know what happened. Boots. Big boots. What the heck? Big boots saved the day for some reason. I don't understand what just happened. How did he take damage? What? I didn't throw anything at him. Okay, let's pause the video there for a second. Alright, so wondering how he died just there. The reason he died was because I threw the watermelon at him, and he jumped away from the platform just as I threw it, but the watermelon landed on the platform. So after he jumped away, and he did his attack, he jumped back to the platform, which I originally threw the uh, watermelon at, and he landed on the watermelon, which for some stupid reason caused him damage. So yeah, that's kind of an anticlimactic way to die, but that's how it happened. I'm so confused. Oh, okay. You know what I should have been doing? I should have been. I don't think those dogs Finally, spawn unless I, I got you kill them. Right where I want you. So this I should have been just throwing those boot. at them. Don't worry. This will only hurt a lot. <laughs> hey, where does mask go? I love this job. Bigger boots. Bigger boots. This bigger boot saved our lives. Yay! Thank, Thank you, stranger. So happy. It's the Cyclops. And so, the Cyclops! What? Escaped the clutches of the mad in the middle of them. It's like Plankton. Only to be captured by the even more hideous Cyclops. And then, they passed out. Awakening in a dreamy, goopy, goober wonderland where... Oh, wait a minute. Hey, it's the goopy goober. Patrick, <gasps> there's the goopy goober himself. Oh boy. As I was saying... SpongeBob and Patrick continued on, allowing nothing to distract them. It's just a dream. Don't waste your time. Uh, go ahead. I think they just pulled this out of their butts. I don't remember this being in the movie. <laughs> no, it's a, it might have been a short scene or something if it was in the movie. I haven't seen the SpongeBob movie in years and years, so. Only Goofy Goober knows the way out of Goober. Oh, this looks so fun! Sea Bottom's nuttiest place. It can't be that difficult. I feel like the ring challenge is gonna be really bad in this. And everything looks so brightly colored. It looks really cool. Got balls. Hmm. These old flybys make this all look fun, but I know it's gonna be hell. Guys, Goofy Goober knows the way out of the amusement park. Follow Goofy Goober and don't lose him. Oh, I will. Oh, there he goes! There is no chance of him getting away from us. <laughs> As he just goes away and we're just sitting here. Let him out of our sight. That's lies. If he lies. gets too far away from you, you'll have to start again. Oh, man. I'm scared. I don't really have many memories of this level. I have small memories. When I was looking at the levels before Let's Playing this, I was like, Oh, yeah! I completely forgot about this level. So maybe that's a good sign that it's easy. I don't really know. Oh, for some reason I thought I already had Nitro, but nope. I think I missed Nitro, that's probably why. So yeah, uh... Goofy Goober, this is all a dream! Patrick and Sponge are all meeting their best friend, and I guess, yeah, I don't know how hard it is to keep up with them. Oh god! Oh boy. Holy crap, we just freaking shot that across the world! That was awesome! Yeah, I missed that burger, that might bite me in the butt later. More Goofy Goobers! What the heck is going on here? This is a secret passage, and I know there's a treasure chest behind here. So you need to get it before we run out of time. Yeah. I didn't even get it! No! He got away! He didn't get away, he was right there! <laughs> what? <laughs> no. Stop beating me, you what? Oh, thanks, Patrick. Thanks for that invigorating tip. Alright, wait, how many treasure chests are in this level? Three. Follow that peanut. Wait, is there only. Oh, never mind. I was saying, is there only one time challenge in this one? No, there's two. Uh, of course. <laughs> this is probably a rubber band effect where it's like if you get close to him, he goes faster, and if you're far away, he goes slower. Oh, yeah, this thing again. Hey, we didn't hit any of the freaking. Bowling balls. <laughs> oh man, okay, we're, I want that treasure chest really badly, so let's go for it again. I mean, 
We should not. This shouldn't be difficult. I thought I got the first time, but apparently not. Let's take a look what it is. Save the money. Extras. And of course, it's a freaking story movie. Maybe the story movie is just for this game. Like, you know, it's just the same scenes we already saw. Is it behind? Let's watch him drive by us again. Nope, we didn't see him drive by us. Okay, at least we have the treasure chest. I am happy. I am happy. Cause I'm happy. First lap. There's multiple laps. Uh oh. I don't like the sound of that. At least when you hit the, the street lamps in this one, they don't just bend and like act like a wall. They actually break. Our Krabby Patty Wagon must have gotten an upgrade at some point. Oh my god, Patrick! Oh, that was. That was my impression of SpongeBob. SpongeBob, I, whenever I was, or when I was a kid, I would always like do um, impressions of characters, which I still do now, obviously, but I mean like the cartoon characters, and I would like, try really freaking hard to get all of them correct. And um, SpongeBob was one I could never even get close to, and it really frustrated me because I really wanted to do. Like I was really happy with my Patrick voice, my Squidward voice, and my Mr. Krabs voice. My dad was make my dad was gonna make him a Mr. Krabs voice. Um, but yeah, I could never get SpongeBob like even close to it. It made me really frustrated. Drop Nitro. Well, I do now. Yeah. Oh, I did have Nitro. Glad I didn't test that because that was kind of a really bendy spot. I need a straightaway. That's probably the only place that's good to use nitro in like straightaways. But, well, definitely gonna be going on water slide later. I got the feelings. We Well gumballs! Where are those even coming from? Oh the gumball machine. Well that makes Whoa! Whoa! What? <laughs> God God is really shot at me. My eyebrow was so itchy right now. Oh there's a treasure chest! Well, guess I'll be back there later. Why is that even there? That's not even hidden. That's just on the main course. Second lap. I feel like he probably gets faster now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah. I'm not looking forward to doing the ring challenge here. Holy crap! Especially with all these gumball. I feel like those gumball things are those ice cream things are gonna probably be the worst part of the ring challenge. Maybe even the race too. No, I'm not. Shush. I have four nitros. Yeah, what up? See, that he definitely went quicker there. Oh no, explosions! There we go. So that was a good spot to use Nitro. Now my knee is really itchy. I stopped to scratch my eyebrow. But now my knee is really itchy. Alright, here we go. Scratch my knee! There we go. More- Oh, I knew it! I knew more of those were gonna fly at me. Uh, I'm trying, I'm trying! I'm trying here! He's gonna go through the secret passage this time? No, he's not. Maybe he goes through the last one. I feel like he does. Yeah, hey, I got a burger. I got my burger back. Burger back. Burger back. Ribs. Yeah, somehow he was able to get away from me when I went for that treasure chest, though. Since you know, I was still on the main course, and he was—he drove right by me the first time I did that. Okay. Is he going up there this time? No, he's not. Probably on the third lap. I vaguely remember him doing that, so I'm pretty sure he does. Good spot to use Nitro. That'll probably be useful in the races as well. Ow. Oh, come on! I totally touched that burger. Well, not really. But I felt like I was close enough for it to drag towards me. There we go. Is there a secret passage in here? Okay, well, there's a treasure chest. Got it. I'm gonna lose him, probably, maybe. Holy crap, where'd he go? There he is. Alright, I'm gonna catch him. Catch up to him. The goofy goober, yeah. I only collected half the treasure chest in this. I feel like one's probably up that water slide somewhere, and I have no idea where the last one might be. Two nitro. For second, for second there, I thought it was my last nitro. I'm like, I probably shouldn't have used that. Oh man, no! <laughs> Something important just fell off, Patrick said, in case you can hear him. I don't know if you go slower or not when you take damage. I've. It feels like we are, but I don't know if we are. I guess it doesn't go through that secret passage at all, the one that we got the first treasure chest from. We probably do for the ring challenge, though. Definitely feel like that's a lot shorter than going this way, so we'll have to do that when we're reading the time challenges. We There we go, got the burger. Got the big! The big! There we go, I knew it! Oh boy, here we go. 
Okay, thankfully we have walls up here. Uh, it was a good, easy spot to lose them, though. Look at them, just up there. Ahead of me. Taunting me. Treasure chest? No treasure chest, eh? Oh, he's got the weight. Thankfully, that light didn't stop me. Uh. Woo, we did it! Yay! Phew. That was really stressful. <laughs> well done, Patrick and Steve Bob. Here's your reward. Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. She said my name first. <laughs> Aww, so happy. Yay! We did it! Look at that giant Goofy Hubert statue spinning around up there. How dare it, mocking me. <laughs> Freaking narcissistic butthead. You think there's only one Goofy Goober? Or, well, I guess when we did see Sponge multiple. SpongeBob and Patrick awaken from their sweet dreams of ice cream sundaes and dancing peanuts, they discover that they have become prisoners of the Cyclops. No! So you see, gentle viewers, our heroes had at long last made it to Shell City and had discovered its awful secret. Shell City was ah! nothing more than a souvenir shop. Those who were captured oh! were dried up and turned into smelly knickknacks. And that is precisely what was happening to our two friends. The situation Aww. seemed to be completely and utterly Look at his belly button. hopeless. But they were saved by the tear of the goofy goobill, as well as a conveniently placed sprinkler system. King Neptune's <laughs> crown lay nearby, but our heroes still needed to escape the treacherous depths of Shell City and get past their most dangerous adversary, the Cyclops. Oh no! Google eyes and smelly knickknacks. Oh man, this level, if I thought we know Weenie Parking was bad and this Rock, or Shell City? Rock City thing place. was bad, but don't worry, then this one is like impossible. Treasure chest, yay. Oh boy, look at those eyeballs! I think those are eyeballs. That's creepy. Good job getting the crown. Oh, thank you. Are you kidding? That was easy. There wasn't even a level for yeah, it. We are the manliest of men. Then what about the hopelessness? Hopelessness? The weeping? When we almost died. You must have been watching over someone else. Never mind. There's no time to waste. Find a way out of here, get past the Cyclops, and back to the Krusty Krab too. Yay, we're almost to the end of the game. Alright, as you see, we only have two, four, five levels left in the game. And we have a lot of treasure chests collecting again, a lot of uh, s slide and racing levels to do. Um, sniffle, sniffle. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. In the next one, we'll do the googly eyes and smelly neck. Actually, we'll probably go back to Sunday driving, do the time challenge, the ring challenge, and the other time challenge. I don't feel like that one will be too difficult, although I didn't think the mini parking one would be hard either. Thank you guys so much for watching. This episode is way too long. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!